Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Mary. I upload videos weekly. Um, I'm trying to get to Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. I was just doing Mondays and Fridays, but I've just I'm trying to focus on growing my channel, so I'm gonna do more uploads. And I'm also, this whole year, the year of 2021, I am doing a monthly giveaway on my channel. So make sure to go ahead and subscribe so you can see all the details on that. So let's just go ahead and jump into this video. I am doing a lipstick declutter today. I actually filmed this twice because I messed up the first time. And as you can tell at the end of the video, my arm gets really, really red because I swatched all the lipsticks too. I did that for my eyeshadow palette declutter and got a really, a lot of great feedback from doing that. So I did that today. So we're just gonna skip the intro and just get straight into the declutter. Okay guys, we're going to start this off with my lip glosses and lip oils. So I actually have two lip oils. I have this one from um, the Tarte Sister brand Sugar Rush, I think is what it is. And this is in the shade Dragon Fruit. And then this is from Yensa. It's a lip oil in the shade Pink Shine. I'm going to be keeping both of these um, just because they're the only two oils that I have. This is the Tarte one. And this is the Yensa one. Oh, did I just break it? Oh no. Hold on. Oh, hold on. Oh my gosh. Let's try this again. Oh, that's lovely. <laughs> oh, and this one, like there's really not any pigment to them. But where's my camera? Where are you? Where's my camera? Those two. Yeah, keeping both. Next, I have these two Fenty ones. This is in Diamond Milk. And this one is, what is it, Fenty Glow? So I'm gonna be keeping both of these. Um, this one is a clear one, so it doesn't really have any pigment, but the Fenty Glow one has a nice little color to it. These are my favorite lip gloss formulas, so I'm definitely gonna be keeping both of these for sure. Okay, one that I'm going to get rid of is this one from Alamar Cosmetics. Um, this is just too thick. It's a really pretty color though. I feel like pinks, but it's just, for my personal liking, it's just too thick. So I will be getting rid of this one. Um, another one that is new to my collection, but I will be keeping is from Essence. It's just a plain clear gloss, and this is super cheap too. It's like two bucks, so I will be keeping this one. It's not as like thin as the Fenty one, but I still do like it. Just a clear, a nice clear gloss. Um, here's another one I'll get rid of. This is from Dominique Cosmetics. This looks pretty old. I think I've had it for a while. It's from their Lemonade collection. This is in the shade Peach Tea. Now this smells absolutely amazing, but I just don't use it. And it's a little bit too, too much for me. This, this one right over here. So I will be getting rid of this one too. Next I have this one from MAC. It's in the shade Mystic Powers. I think I like this one. Let me just look at it again. Yeah, I do like this one. So I will be keeping this guy. Again, that's it right there. Another one I'm keeping is from Buxom. It's their White Russian. This is a classic. It's like a plumping one too, but it's not like overpowering like the Too Faced ones. It's really pretty and it's a classic color. So I will be keeping this one too. I knew I was gonna be keeping a lot of these. Next is from ColourPop. It's from their Hades, their Villains collection. It's the Hades one in Hothead. I really haven't worn this, gosh, at all, I don't think. Um, but I really love Hercules. Oh. You know what? I don't ever use it, so I'm going to get rid of it. Oh, that one hurt me a little bit. Um, next I have from Ofra Cosmetics. It's the Madison Miller collab. It's in the shade Smiley for Riley, I think. I actually won this in a giveaway, and I do really like the formula. It's really lightweight. It's a really subtle, like, apricot color. Really pretty, so I will keep this one, too. And then the last one is from... No idea. I think it's... Half Caked is the name of the brand. Yeah, Half Caked. And this in the shade Rich Rich. I actually don't even think I've ever swatched this. Um, 
you know what, I, I'm not a huge fan of it, but I don't really have a, a normal pinky one. It's this one down here. Um, so I will be keeping this since I got rid of the Alomar one. So I'll keep this one. So I got rid of three and I'm keeping one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So not too bad. Okay, so we are back with the liquid lipsticks now. So let's go ahead and kick it off. This is from ColourPop. It's their Disney designer collection. This is in the shade Prince Charming. I do really like this one. I like the formula of it. So I will be keeping this one. Um, I will also be keeping this from Dose of Colors. This is in the shade Merlot. I really like the, their formula. So keeping this too. Um... This is from Jeffree Star Cosmetics, boo, um, in the shade 818. I definitely will not be keeping this. I don't, why the heck did I even buy this in the first place? Like, when would I ever wear that? Never. So getting rid of that. Um, this is another one I'm going to get rid of. It's from Maybelline. They're super stay. I like the formula, but I just, I just don't ever wear this one. This is in the shade Ruler. Really pretty. I just... Don't wear it, so I'll get rid of that one. Um, let's see. This is from Clarins. I have only worn this a couple times, but I do really like the formula, so I'm actually going to keep this. It kind of gives like a blurred out effect. You can kind of see, so I like that. I'll keep that one. Um, let's jump over here to these two faced ones. This is in the shade Lady Balls this red one right here I do really like this I love the Too Faced formula so I will be keeping this one this nice pretty red color so this one is in the shade Queen B I will 100% be keeping this one as well I don't have anything like this it's just such a cool toned lip that I really really love and then this is also Staying in my collection, I got it last year. It's their pumpkin spice color. Absolutely love this so, so much. So keeping those two. I'm also going to be keeping all three of these. These are from The Balm. This is like, gosh, my favorite um, formula. This is in the shade Affectionate right here. I just love this one so much. And then this one is Faithful. And these have like a mint smell to them. I really like it. And then the last one from the bomb is Committed. Pew, pew, pew. So I'm keeping all of those. All right, so the last four from the Liquid Lips all actually kind of look really similar. So I have this red one. It's all from this brand called Half Caked. This is in the shade 82 Bordeaux. Um, I'm going to get rid of this one. And then these two look really similar. So this is shade low key right here. And this one is ASAP. They look pretty dang similar in my opinion. Um, I'm just going to keep ASAP and get rid of low key. And then the last one is in the shade theme song and I'm gonna go ahead and keep this one too so this is what we are keeping I have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven keeping eleven liquid lips and then I am getting rid of these four okay guys this is the lipstick bullets which is the largest part of my collection and also the last so let's go ahead and jump into it. I have this shade from MAC in Twig. This is one of my favorites, so I definitely will be keeping that. More from MAC is in this shade Snob. This is like this pretty cool tone pink. I will be keeping that as well. Honestly, I feel like I'll be keeping most of my MAC stuff. Um, this is Mocha. It's more of like a mid-tone brown shade kind of so obviously keeping that um i will not be keeping this one this is in the shade all fired up this is a mini 
I think this is like a free gift, but I've never used that. That is just not something I would ever wear. So I will be getting rid of that. And this is my last MAC one in the shade Cream in Your Coffee. I definitely will be keeping this too. It's just such a pretty color. I love the MAC formula. So there are those. Okay, let's do all these Hank and Henry ones. Um, this is in the shade Tequiro, which is that. And I am not going to keep that. I don't think I've ever used it. Next, we have this one in Lust. And I'm not going to keep that one either, so get rid of those two. Next, we have the shade Touched, which is this like pinky shade. Okay, that's pretty. I'll keep that one. And then this one is in the shade Tiamo. I love how you open these. You just like press the button and it pops open. This is a really pretty. Yeah, that's like your um, basic red. We'll be keeping that. And then we have Orgasmic. See, this is how you open it. You press the button, pops out. This is a really bright pink. I don't know when I would ever use this, but also I don't have any other shades like this, so I feel like I should just keep it on the off chance that I need it. So I'll keep that one. And the last one is Love, which is more of like a deeper red. So pretty. So I'm going to keep that one too. Okay, let's grab some random ones. This is from Milani. It's in the shade Double Espresso. This is like the only like true, true brown that I have. So I'm going to keep that one. I have this from e.l.f. This is new to my collection. It's in the shade Taffy. It's a really pretty pink, like a rosy pink. So I'm going to keep that one. Let's see. I have this from Rachel Lisa, which she was the makeup artist who did my makeup for our wedding ceremony. Um, I don't really know what this is. It says Brazilian Bear. So since like this is my wedding lip. I'm definitely going to keep that just because you know it's special to me. So keeping that one. Let's see. These are from I don't even know what this is from. I think it's like Tristique or something. I have no idea. But it's in the shade Sunset Boulevard which is this pretty pink one. Um, I don't think I need that so I'm going to get rid of that. And then also from the same brand. This is in the shade Here to Slay which is a red I don't think I need that either, so I'm going to get rid of that too. Okay, let's do these ColourPop ones. So this is in the shade 7 Springs. Uh, oh, heck no. Definitely don't even know why I have that. I think about the whole collection. And this is Spring Roll. Um, I think I like that. I'll keep that one. Next we have Tea Time. That's pretty. I'll keep that one too. And then we have Moody Bloom. This is like the only berry shade I have, so I definitely will be keeping that. Then I have Your Thriving. I'm going to pass that up. Get rid of that one. Let's see. We have Flower Season. Um, I don't need that. I have the other two Hank and Henry reds, so I don't need that red too. And then this is the last ColourPop one. It's from their Villains collection, and this is the Hades one, which Hercules is my all-time favorite Disney movie, so I will be keeping this one. Let's do these Becca ones. I'm pretty sure I'm going to keep all three of them. I have the shade Sugar. These are all little minis. So there's sugar. Keeping this one is rosewood. I can already tell you I'm keeping that. Meep. These are so pretty and the formula is amazing. And the last one is orchid, which I think is my favorite one. Yeah, so I'm keeping all three of those. And I will be getting rid of this one. It's from Sol de Janeiro. So I don't even think it's like a lipstick. It's more like a lip butter. So there's not really anything there. So I'm going to get rid of this one too. Okay, so this is from NYX. It's a black shade in Alien. Um, 
this is the only like black lipstick I have. Well, I have one more, but I'm going to keep this one just in case I ever need it. But I can tell you, like, I don't think I'm hardly going to keep any of these. I got these from Amazon. It's from a brand called like Clean Colors. I have this white one. Oh my word. Why did I get these trash? I'm getting rid of that one. This purple one. Okay, I'll keep that one. Just until, like, if I ever get a nice purple one, then I'll get rid of that one. Here's the other black. Let's put next to this one. Yeah, that is definitely getting decluttered. And then this gray one. Yep, decluttered. Y'all, look at my hands. They're getting red. <laughs> this blue one. That one's okay. I'll keep that one. And then this other blue one yeah that's getting decluttered too okay so out of the lips I'm getting rid of one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen I'm getting rid of thirteen and I'm keeping one two three Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. That is not too bad. So here is everything that I'm keeping. I have a total of forty-one items that I am keeping right here. Not too bad. We will see where, where we're at at the end of the year. And here is what we are getting rid of. That is a total of 20 items. So overall, not too bad. Did pretty good. But um, that is all I have for you for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And then just be on the lookout for more videos. Thanks again, guys. See you next time.